Hey, what's going on? It's Lucas. All right, uh, super quick. Um, an issue that I had with Splice is that when I'm making music, I don't really want to browse for samples here. Uh, this interface is cool, but you can only uh, click and drag like one at a time. I want to use Ableton and uh, use the browser here and be able to hot swap so I can hear the samples in the context of my song. So if we just locate the splice sample pack, um, you can pull it up in Ableton, but you're stuck with this. It's like a million folders and they have subfolders and it's, it's horrible. So um, check out this little workaround I have. If you, if you go to your settings, hit go to folder, it'll just take you there immediately. Here's all your packs. Um, so this is what I did. First, let me just open up two finder windows to make this easy. Move one on each side. Um, I'm going to go to my samples folder or wherever it is that you want to uh, have your samples moved to. So I just created a new folder and just labeled it Splice September 2021. If we go here to our packs and you hit command F, you can sort or search rather by kind and do music. And then it'll show you all of the WAV files or other music files. Some of them are AIFFs. Um, so you can hit Command A and then hold Option on Mac and just move this into any folder that you want to. So I already did that here. And I also went a step further and literally just organized them. Um, if you hit Command F again and just search, you can go like by each type and just do 808, kick, snare, all those and just move them into a folder. Um, so I went ahead and did that already. The reason why I'm doing this is because in Ableton, uh, if you're hot swapping and searching uh, uh, from too many files at once, it's going to get really slow and you're going to get the rainbow wheel. So I went ahead and did that. You can hit in Ableton add folder and now my new folder with all my splice sa samples organized is right here and I put um, just like I basically used you know what I had to come up with these categories that they're pretty basic so you have kick snare hat um, clap and that kind of thing but I think each these are a little bit more palatable for Ableton to be able to search so if I want to hot swap between these um, I can do that and it won't give me any issues oops sorry one of the MIDI track right so I, now I can hot swap here and it's no problem so no rainbow wheel. Let me know if that helps or if you have any other workarounds for this. I think uh, Splice is pretty sweet. I would just prefer to browse the samples in Ableton instead of in their uh, little app. So thank you. Later.